Okay, everyone, it's Dr. Zubin Damania. Check it out. Uh, so many people have messaged me, what do you think about the HPV vaccination? Now, it doesn't matter that we've made dozens of videos with guests, without guests, talking about HPV and how strongly I feel that every person who's eligible for this vaccination should get it. But I just wanna summarize really quickly. Bottom line, get this vaccination. Children, both boys and girls, between 11 and 12, that's when you most often start giving this vaccination. And now they've even expanded FDA approval to up to 45 years old. Doesn't mean insurance will cover it, but it's been expanded. Why is this vaccination so important? Because it can prevent cancer. Let me repeat that. It is a vaccine that can prevent cancer. Why? Because the human papillomavirus is almost on par with smoking in terms of how many worldwide cancers it causes. We're talking about cervical cancer, anal cancer, vaginal and vulvar cancers, and head and neck cancers, throat cancers. So basically we're talking about both boys and girls, not to mention, speaking of boys, penile cancers. And why is this? Because the virus itself can trigger cancerous growth and it is transmitted sexually. So oral sex, vaginal sex, anal sex. That's how the virus gets around. Now, why do we vaccinate? To prevent the infection of people with this virus. Why? Because almost 90% of adults will have been infected at some point due to this kind of sexual contact. And if you think that your child is never gonna have sex or that they're gonna wait till they're married, well, that doesn't mean their spouse didn't have sex and waited till they're married. So the chances of getting infected, again, 90% roughly by the time you're a grown up. So if you get the vaccination, it covers against nine, the Gardasil 9, the latest one, against nine of the most common strains of HPV that can not only cause cancer, but also cause yucky genital warts which you also probably don't want. Why are we even talking about this? Because the professional delusional anti-vax movement has spent tons of time online convincing parents not to give this vaccine to their children. You've probably heard about the Japanese Ministry of Health. You've probably heard about the secret HPV researcher who now says, don't give this vaccine. You've probably heard about girls who are permanently disabled from this vaccine. Let me just cut to the chase. It's all lies. None of it has to do with the vaccine itself. This is one of the most studied vaccines in the history of vaccines. Massive trials have shown not only is it safe, but it's also effective, reducing the number of precancerous pre cervical lesions that we're seeing in women. This vaccine works and it's safe. Now, I'm not gonna go into every single point and refute every single point, but I'm gonna link to a skeptical Raptor piece where they have summarized pretty much every objection to this vaccine and all the data showing that it's bullshit. So bottom line, share this video with parents and patients who are on the fence about getting this vaccine. It will prevent cancer. It is safe and effective. What you've heard about it on the negative side online is wrong and full disclosure, Merck ain't paying me shit. I'm looking at you, Merck. I want my money. Z-Dog out.